Hi, it's good to see you again. Great to start the weekend with Detroit. Indeed. Okay, so Hello everybody, my name is Mr. King and Wait, and welcome back to Detroit. This I have not played this game in a very long time and I should have been playing it more. So without further ado, let's continue the story. Now, I'm not sure where we're at, but let's find out. Oh, okay. Okay, um, I can't quite remember what this is. I think, I think I'm playing as Marcus. I can't quite remember. Oh, I've forgotten all the buttons. Oh god, I should have been playing this way more. Okay, um, okay. So apparently this is one android or only an android could see. That's one. I think I saw the other one there. Yep. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. So now I need to find the other one somewhere. So blue, yellow, red and pink wall. Okay, so we need to look for that now. Can I run? Oh, I can. Alright, okay. Hmm. Not quite sure where that is. Hmm. Don't know. Am I going the right way or am I going the wrong way? This is quite difficult. Oh. Oh, I have found it. Oh, I didn't even realise. Okay, that's one. Uh, oh. Two. Already. Yes. Okay. Some more robots. Oh, and I'm stuck in a pole. Okay, here we go. <coughs> it's crazy to think, but Marcus is now wearing human clothes, and he stuck his little circle thing out. So, he's not really an android anymore. He's his own person. Hmm. It's very strange. Weird to think that. Okay, so it's there's some fencing and there's a robot there. This may take a while. Hmm. This may take a while. Oh, no, I found it. It's over here. Okay, that's one. That looks like a two. That looks like a three. Uh, uh. Okay, so that's basically obstructed. So I can't see it because that blanks in the way. So let's do it. <coughs> I love this game so much. I should have been playing more of this, but I'll try and uh, I'll try and complete this. Oh. There we go. Now we can do the last one. Here we go. Alright. Okay. Hmm. So we need to find Jericho, I think. If I remember correctly, it's Jericho. That's that one up there. Is that up there? Doesn't look like it's up there. Hmm. That's a shark one. Oh, there it is. There's three of them now. There's the other one. There's the other one. Hmm. Yeah, I need, I need to find a way to reach the roof now. Uh, oh, how about this? Yes, good. Alright, cool. Okay. <laughs> I love that Mox just looks at it like I've just accomplished so much. In a way, he has. 
already. He's become an android and then changed that, and now he's still an android, but in human shoes, basically. That's a long way down. Oh, that does not look safe. Should we not go that way, Marcus? Oh, pre-construct, okay. Uh, let's start over there. Jump off the wall. Run onto the ledge. Swing, and then the safe landing. Ooh, that's unlocked. Reconstruct. Whoa. Wow. That is insane that a robot, aka Android, can do that. That's really cool. Uh, sparkles was that? Or Parkle? Parkle something. Okay. Let's drop down. I think I saw it just then. <coughs> Excuse me. Jeez. Yes, there it is. Okay. Uh, how many to find that? Well, that one. Hmm. Where's the other one? Oh, there's two. And oh, there's three. Nice clue updated. Oh, what's that? Hmm. Interesting. None of this looks safe. We may have done a bit of this in the last video, I'm not sure. Let's try this one. Oh yeah, that looks... That already looks safe. Uh, nope, I didn't want to do that. Oh wait, was that good? I think that might have been good. Up there? Would be too high. Uh, okay. This way? And incomplete. Ah. Interesting. All right. Let's do it. This game is absolutely gorgeous. It's amazing. Wow. The detail in this game is insane. It looks so cool. <coughs> Excuse me again. Jeez. Hmm. Alright, so we're looking for a broken wall. Uh, these two over here? No, they don't have a red thing near it. Ooh. Hold up a minute. I think we may have found it. Here we go. Okay, so now we need to go back to... Oh wait, hold up. Two planks and then a little rock is broken. Oh, is it this over here? Could be. Looks like it. We have to mash the X button. Okay. Interesting. Oh. Hmm. I wonder where this is leading, Marcus. Jericho, already. Wow. Well, we found Jericho. It's a boat. It's it's a really big boat. Reach the boat. Okay. Hmm. Bad feeling about this. Oh, that looks safe. Oh dear. Yes, Marcus. That's fell down. That doesn't look too great. Let's not go that way. Hmm. Anyway, this way that we can go? Oh, apparently so. Okay. 
Hmm. Oh, it changed. Find another way to the boat. Yes. Hmm. Very interesting so far. This is very interesting. Nope. This doesn't look safe. Oh no, he's not gonna do what I think he's gonna do. Is he actually gonna jump onto the boat? There's no way. Although that is water. Oh god, it says jump. Alright guys, we need a bit of a run up. Okay. Do it. That's the biggest run up I've ever seen. Okay. Whoa. Ah, oh, he lost his coat. <coughs> he lost Marcus's coat. Oh. What's inside the boat? What's this? Oh, it's a flashlight. Oh, it's a shakeable one. Interesting. Alright. Hmm, anything around here? Hmm. Oh, there's another door. Of course it's locked. Okay. In there? No, that doesn't look too great. Oh, there are stairs here, though. Are they in use? Probably not. Hmm. Oh! Almost missed that. There's another way down here. Or through here. Alright. Hmm. We are not having any luck, are we? With these doors. Maybe humans actually did come here. Tech addict. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Android astronauts to explore Io. Interesting. Well. NASA sends Android, Android crew into space. Now that would be a cool thing in my opinion, but I don't know. But it's worth a try, to be honest. It's worth a try. Alright, this is not creepy at all. It's completely fine. This is not terrifying at all, Jesus Christ. I think I'm going to need a minute, guys. Jesus Christ. Oh, I can't even. What the hell? Jesus Christ. I didn't think this game was scary. It was supposed to be scary. The Last of Us is supposed to be scary. Wow. That's uh, not annoying at all. Jesus Christ. Alright, this could be the only possible door at this point. Christ, I actually generally got scared then. Oh my god. Why is this game so scary? Oh god, I 
I swear, if there's any more jump scares, I will have you, honestly. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ooh. Ooh, dear. That was a heavy landing. Go, oh, Marcus. You can do it. Oh, that's a lot of androids. Whoa. Welcome to Jericho. This is Jericho? Oh my god, look at all the... Wow, that... That still blows my mind. This game is insane. Look at all those things. That's one level and it's only 86% complete. What did I miss right there? And ask androids the way to Jericho. I didn't realise that was an option. So I missed... Oh, and another one there. Which peeled off in its own direction and stopped apparently. Hmm. And another one. And another one. Oh my god, this game is insane. Wow. Well, let's continue. <coughs> November the 6th, 2034, I believe that said. Thanks, neutral at the minute. Okay, so we're playing as Connor, probably one of my favourite Android players at the minute. Next to Marcus as well. Right, look at the detail. Jeez. Alright. Don't know why we're here, but. Chicken. Last shit hot tip you gave me sent me back a week's wages. Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. Alright. Who is this guy? Uh, Ada Pedro. Pedro Abdar. Is that his name? Am I saying that right? Born, well, 2005. Unemployed. Criminal record. Illegal gambling and fraud. Well, he's already a criminal. That's that's guaranteed. 100% guaranteed, should I say. Uh, license expired. Uh, food hygiene. Reward. Renewed refund or oh, refused, sorry, 2031. The same year, jeez. All right, how about the chef? Uh, Gray Kays, is that his name? Born 1988, business owner, criminal record, residing arrest, breach of hygiene. Regulations, okay. And Hank. At the minute, what's Hank feeling? Lieutenant Anderson, or Hank, Lieutenant Hank Anderson. Born 1985, police lieutenant, criminal record, none. As every cop should not have. <laughs> All right, I'm in. Are you buying drugs? Oh dear. Hey, won't regret this. Uh oh. So I have to step in. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. Hmm. Should I say something? Right, let's apologize for whatever we did. I can't quite remember. I'm sorry for my behavior back at the police station. I didn't mean to be unpleasant. Oh, wow. You've even got a brown-nosing apology program. Guys at Cyberlife thought everything, huh? Yeah, probably. Who knows? Here you go. Here we go. Okay, what's this food? Is it good or is it bad? 
sugar, carbonated pineapple passion. Okay. Carbonated pineapple passion. Uh, oh, that's a lot of calcium. Uh, lipids. Mm -hmm. Carbohydrates. Uh, I was going to say 60. 53 grams water. 53. Yeah, 53% salt and 2.2 grams. Hmm, not sure that's the best type of food to have. Maybe stick to vegetables, Hank. You're looking a bit plump. Oh, uh, thanks, Gary. I'm starving. I'll leave that thing here. Oh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. Anything else I can scan? Can I order food? Oh, what's this? It's a hockey match. Alright, I don't know who's playing, because I don't properly follow hockey. Hmm. Well, it looks like we're watching this all day. Hmm. Not again, board. There's nothing much happening. Okay. Gambling, uh, cholesterol, uh, company. Enjoy your meal. You know what? I'm just gonna say enjoy your meal. If he wants to eat bad food, he enjoy can eat bad meal. meal. Thank you. Have it? Mmm. Have it. Do you eat here often? Most days. Gary wow, makes that's... the best burger in Detroit. No. Okay. About myself, Connor. Alright. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. No. <laughs> no. Alright. Deviants. Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, right. which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Okay. Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. <laughs> mm. Well, he's got a point. Maybe they're not so different after all. Maybe they're not. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? <coughs> Why do you hate androids so much? I have my reasons. You ever dealt with deviants before? Oh. A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with a little girl. Oh. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me? Truth or lie? Yep, yeah, let's go with the truth. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. Hmm. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years and mm -hmm. you spend a lot of time in bars. So what's your conclusion? Hmm. You say Bill I can't even read that word to you. Alright, let's go with that. I know you're an experienced officer. Hmm. And I'd like to earn your trust. Yep. I'm sure we can solve this case if we manage to work together. Sure. Oh, Hank's got it. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. Alright. Interesting. So Hank is now hey friends with it. You run out of batteries or what? 
I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh, well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. <laughs> oh my god, I love that about color. It's so funny. It's just there. What do we know about this guy? Alright, let's move Not out of much. the habitat of the elevator, shall we? Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. This floor. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but mm. the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his. Oh, what's this? I'm not sure, guys, if we've done half of these Christ, missions before. I'm not every sure. Time somebody hears a strange noise. We're gonna need more cops. Yeah, probably. All right. Well, let's know. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Correct. Okay, let's knock a bit louder. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit police! Stay behind me. Got it. <laughs> nice. Alright. This may get a little bit more. Alright, I've got to stay behind Lieutenant Anderson. Let's try that, shall we? Hold up. Is there anything else there? No. What's that though? There. Hmm. What the yeah. fuck is this? Pigeons, mate. Pigeons. Ugh. Jesus, this place stinks. Well, yeah. Uh uh, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. Hmm. Well. Lieutenant, can you move out the way, please? Thank you. There we go. Hmm. Okay. First thing I've noticed, it says UFO over Oh, not UFO. UFT. <laughs> Uh, I can't read today. That's funny. <laughs> UFO. Oh wow. All right, what's this? Hmm. Oh. Let's unlock something. In the corner. Remove. Huh? Ah, what's this? Let's have a look. <sighs> I need some fresh air. Hmm. Some weird shapes. Found something? Yeah. I don't know. It looks like no. a notebook, but it's indecipherable. Right. What's this? RT, second hand. RT. Oh. Probably initials. Did not get to read that. Put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in for. Hmm. Fake ID. The driver's hmm. license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come, come for nothing. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. All right. What's in the fridge? Nothing. Spec doesn't eat. Hmm. Ah, oh, that means we're looking for an android. Or worse. Oh, did you move? Hmm. Animal food? Interesting. Maybe the android has a hobby. Just feeding pigeons. Hmm. <coughs> Sample or take? Ah, Jesus, I hate these things! Sample. Oh, uh, that's weird. Okay. Forgot he did that. I wish I'd have picked take you know, instead of sample. Ooh. Disgusting. Oh, and we get to do both. Ah, he took his thing out. Oh, dear. Ah, he took his LED out. Its LED is in the sink. I'm surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. Hmm. RA9? What does that mean? Hmm. That's interesting. 
Any idea what it means? Nope. RA-9. Written 2,471 times. Wow. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? Looks like mazes or something. Hmm. Yes. Interesting. What's this? It's a stool. Okay. What does this do? Opened marker pen. Okay, that's... Hmm. Wooden stool. Oh, reconstruct. Interesting. Alright, let's see what we have here. Suspect was here recently. So... Ooh. Ooh, that's interesting. That's very interesting. So, hmm. Oh, if we analyze this as well. Alright. Uh, skid mark, recent. It must have been when it fell or something. Oh, fingerprints. Uh, finger marks, recent. Traces of. What? Are they in. Official matter? Oh, right. Bird poop. Interesting. Hmm, and a metal hook to hold up the cage. Alright, eh, let's reconstruct. Let's see where our deviant is at. Ah, so we knocked that over. Ah, what's that? So, he went over there, knocked that over. And then we're not there. Oh dear. Birdseed. I can't believe it. This nut job was actually feeding these fuck. <coughs> uh oh. God damn fucking pigeons. Oh, okay. What are you waiting for? See that. Chase it. Alright. Oh, oh no, it's gonna be one of those quick time events. I mean, I'm quite good at quick time events, but how quick are these events going to be? Oh, lost a lot of time there. Fast. Alright, let's go this way. Oh god, you do not have a lot of time in there. Uh, secret bam uh, balance. This one. Okay. A little bit too. Cool. Oh, there ain't got crowded. Okay, let's do it. Circle. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Whoa. This is cool. Oh god. Where are we going? Oh, this way. Oh god. How is he up there already? Oh my god. Slow but uh, fast but risky. I'm gonna go straight forward, fast but risky. Let's just do it. Like it works. Nope, we were fine, we did it. Oh my god, what is this? A James Bond film this. Oh god. Alright. Oh, and he jumped off the plane. <coughs> Oh dear. Jump, Hannah, jump. Fine. Alright, let's just do it. Oh, oh, I almost missed that. No. 
it. Just gotta do it. Just gotta do it. Square. Oh yeah. Circle. Oh god. Oh dear, now we can't see him. What? How did he get the... Oh my god! Uh oh. Uh oh. Steven, oh... Duh. Chance of survival range 9. Uh, chase Steven. Uh, I wanna get the Deviant, but I wanna save. Ah, just save Hank. Oh god. Oh shit. my god. Shit. We had it. Jesus Fuck. Christ. It's my fault. I should have been faster. You'd have caught it if it weren't for me. I picked all the fast routes. It was it was Hank. That's alright. We know what it looks like. We'll find it. Oh, I really think I should have picked Deviant, but I don't know. Hey, Connor. Nothing. Alright, okay, so how did Hank get up there before me? That's a six foot building. Or a ten foot story high building, I don't know. I don't how <sighs> Suspect got away, yeah no, no 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 no. We caught the suspect. Okay, so there were two options at the end there. I'm gonna presume we let Hank fall and then capture the deviant, but Hank got there before me, kind of messed it up, so, I don't know, let's continue, nope, oh, Marcus, who are you, fugitives, just like you, my name oh. is Josh, I'm Simon, North, uh, trail, android, Jericho. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Hmm. Free? And hiding just to stay alive. That's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. Hmm, trail? And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decipher the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. Hmm. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho! Yeah. I understand how you feel. But we have more freedom here than you ever did. Hmm. Direct? Lost? I don't know. Direct? Waiting in the dark for something to happen? That's not how I see freedom. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. Lost? I we didn't direct. ask for this. Hmm. All we can do now is deal with it. How? You're safe yeah. here. So many questions. You can stay with us as long as you want. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Okay. Oh, Marcus has been hit by something there. Okay. Well, I'm going to do that in the next video. Um, I don't know. That That's a bit strange, to be honest. But, interesting. So... Thank you guys so much for watching, please like, subscribe, comment down below and follow me at mystery underscore king908 on my Instagram and I'll see you guys in the next video of Detroit Become Human. It's a very interesting episode so I guess we'll find out in the next episode so thank you and goodbye.